forgotten something from somebody who says, let me think about it and you let them go think about it. Has anyone ever? So you might as well say you're not allowed to think about it. You lost them anyway. anyway. They have never, any person who ever says, I'm going to think about it, I guarantee you 99 and 99 one hundredths percent are never going to call you back. It's never happened to me. Never so, had anyone. So, hey, I thought about it. I'm going to go with you. <laughs> you, you might just want to do, go down with a fight. That's, that's what you yeah. do. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, look, lovely Nothing Audrey joined us. Lovely Audrey. I want, I, Audrey, I, I'm, I love the house. My wife loves the house, but we want to think about it. You're not allowed to think about it. I have three other buyers waiting. Would you like this house or not? Oh, my. Oh, you're, na- oh, you're tough. Whoa. That's the mood I'm in today. With after all morning, that's why I'm late. Anyway, <laughs> so that's a real scarcity authority social proof, as Cialdini would say, type of psychological. You you blended three psychological triggers into one sentence there. <laughs> that was pretty good. What what about if we're dealing with um, somebody who's an arrogant lawyer and he doesn't like to be spoken to that way? Uh huh. What do, you, what do you do with a guy like that? Well, you know, no one ever talks you know, to me I, like you know, that. I, 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 you know, uh, what, talk to me. Tell me. What's the hesitation? Well, you know, my wife and I, we don't like to rush into these things. We like to think about it. And you're awfully pu- – you're really pushy, Audrey. You know, uh, uh, we're in California here. People are touchy-feely. Let's have lunch. And you're, you sound like some kind of pushy New Yorker. You know, I am a New Yorker. By the way, I'll take that as a compliment. Thank you. I am a New Yorker, and I appreciate where you're coming from, but the reality is there's a scarcity here. We're looking at the property. I'm, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm assuming you're interested in it, and time is of the essence. We either decide now or it's over. I'm sure you understand that. Yeah. Audrey, okay. off, off the right play. Try it with nurturing. Try it with a little soft. I'm not in a nurturing, nurturing mood today. <laughs> You're not a, who's feeling nurturing today? Okay, I love your honesty. <laughs> who's nurturing today? Felipe, um, do the hard, uh, I like the hard approach Audrey does, direct, honest, straightforward, but then you got to make it nice, nice, if, depending, say the guy is, uh, say the husband and wife are very assertive type personalities. You've got to, and they're a little offended by your directness. How do you make nice, nice? Okay, okay. You know what, sir? You're right. I am a little, you know, I am a little aggressive and, and, uh, but you know, you're a successful attorney and, uh, and, uh, and, and, and you know why you want to get the, I mean, I lost my train of thought, but it's, uh, it's like you give him a stroke and, and then, uh, how, how would that be? Try, uh, okay. The, re- the reality, I, 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 I love what you just said, Felipe. You know what? You're right. You're a high powered attorney, but surely you can appreciate that, you know, we're under the gun here. Time is of the essence. We either have to make a decision now or it's over. If you're willing. Just lost you, Audrey. Yeah, let me unmute. Audrey, you got muted there the last 10 seconds for some reason. Sorry about that. You know, listen, I can appreciate what you're saying, but the reality is, is time is of the essence here. We either have to make a decision right now or we're going to lose this thing. Now, if that's something you're wi- a chance you're willing to take, then by all means, you know, let's lose it. But then it's over. Give me some so, nurturing. I want to hear some nurturing, so, so, touchy feely. Make this. How do we make this prospect turn it around 180 and make them fall in love with you? What could we? What could we possibly say? Someone be creative and make it nurturing. I'll be the. I'll be the arrogant lawyer here. Someone give me shoot me something. It goes those crickets again. It goes those crickets. Okay, who's, let's turn it around. You know, Mr. Bassanz, I know how you feel and everything, and we've been looking at a few houses, but do you want me to tell you that before, and I know I sound a little abrupt, I am a transplanted New Yorker, and somehow I climbed the wall, they let me into San Diego. You know, do you want me to tell you the truth, sir, or just play this little silly fairy tale game? Tell me the truth, Claude. 
This house is perfect for you. And you and your wife, if you don't buy this house, you're going to have regrets the rest of your life because it's perfect for you and your beautiful family. It's exact. It's close to work. It would, show, it would save you a half hour a day in commute time. How much would that be in gasoline? And your time, you're a lawyer. Time is valuable to you. If you could save a half hour each way on your commute because you spent a little bit more in the house, how much more billable hours would you have per year? How, mu how much more would you be able to see your beautiful, you have two lovely children, right? Three, right? Yeah. Three with <laughs> another one on the way. Claude is a very nice name, by the way. Um, oh, yeah, sure. Okay. And you would, you'd be able to see your children and your lovely wife more. You'd have more leisure time. How important is the quality of your life by saving at least 10, 15 hours a week in commuting time? How important is that? And is it worth spending an extra $50,000 over your budget to get that quality of life? Boom. Boom. Okay. I'll accept breathe. a round of applause for that. Boom. Thank you. Thank you. Boom. All right. Do I have to beg for it? Uh, uh, <laughs> the thing about it is, this is why we practice so much. And when you get certain prospects, you know you won't sell. Practice with them. Be creative. Do daring things that nobody else will do. This is how we overcome objections. What are some other What are some other 